Hey everyone. Hello! <laughs> Tell them about your coffee. Um, I'm drinking a, a chocolate orange coffee. Hashtag was, not spawn, but it's it's Bones coffee. It's really tasty. It was amazing. <laughs> I I was like, no, no, I can wait until we get inside. And she's like, but it's chocolate he orange. Was, he was like, I need coffee, but I'm gonna wait till we go in. I was like, I brought one just to share with you. And he was like, never mind, I can't wait. <laughs> yeah, yeah, especially for chocolate orange. <laughs> but yeah, so I don't know how we're gonna do this. So, um, I know it's like weird every single time that I we give each other gifts <laughs> but the reason why i like to film it is because i like to like go back and like see her reaction mm -hmm. like, it, makes, it makes me excited everyone likes to sh and we like to share the joy anyway everyone gets yeah. a little everyone gets joy from seeing other people get joy anyway so yeah, yeah. exactly we like to share the happy moments so yeah because so, <laughs> we get each other crap all the time yeah so i got you some gifts i'm gonna go grab them if okay. you want to just introduce what we're doing today okay <laughs> So, um, I know it hasn't been uh, uh, a long time as it normally is when we do this, but we're back to do another kind of mini shopping haul. Um, we got word that there was a little sale going on, so we're going to hit it up. We're going to try not to do too much damage, but um, we're just going to hit up the good old bookstore and see what we can find on sale. <laughs> Don't look. Oh, not looking. Not looking. <laughs> Look. I'm not looking. Someone's calling you though. I don't know who. <laughs> yeah, it's fine. Is it still recording though? Did it stop? It's okay, still it's still recording. recording. Awesome. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So the first one that you already know about. That I already know. I didn't know about any of yeah, them. Yeah, you knew about this one. Oh yes, I did know about this one. Yes, yes. Thank you, Boo. Got my volume one of Off and Lead. He found it for cheaps online. Yeah, I, I got this used because she said that she wanted it in last video. So this kind of ties in the video. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I'm so happy. Look at how. <laughs> now three more to go, I think. <laughs> yeah, I, I'm it's not a four. sure. It's a four one? I, I'm I, pretty sure I it's four. Yeah, I think it's four. I but think th four. I think there's like two and one or three and one. Probably three. It's a yeah. big boy. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So I will be reading that at some point. I did watch some of the anime and liked it. I watched yeah. the entire anime and I liked it and I wanted more because they left it on a cliffhanger. <laughs> yeah, I, I didn't watch the ending. It was awful. Next gift. Oh, yeah, that was it. <laughs> A coloring book! Wow, Yeah, so you can do that at work. Thank you! Oh, and this one will be... I just got gel pens, and this is perfect because this has all the fine lining details. Yeah. Oh, perfect! Thanks, boo! And then the next one is... You got a villain book. I did. And you can't do the... So this is more of like the flesh colors. Oh, thank you! Did you give me alcohol marker? Yeah! yeah. Thank you! Yeah, so I figured that the flesh... Chisel and fine lining. Yeah. Perfect. Thank you, Boo. I appreciate it. Yeah. Thank you. Of course. <laughs> a car hug. <laughs> uh, but yeah, did you tell them everything that we we're doing? We're gonna go on a hunt. Uh, yeah, I told them we we're doing kind of like a little mini hunt. We got word there was a sale going on, so we're not gonna do. I don't know how much damage he's gonna do, but I'm not gonna do too much damage. Yeah. <laughs> and then um, I didn't tell them we were doing two stops though. <laughs> oh yeah, we're gonna go to Target after this to see what they have, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. and. I have a gift card for mm -hmm. Valentine's Day. Yes. Mm -hmm. So hopefully I don't spend more than like five ish dollars. There we go. Yeah. See, so, like I said, we're going to try not to do too much damage this yeah. time. Okay. <laughs> but anyways, we will see you guys inside. Yay. <laughs>
Maybe. <laughs> Maybe. Yeah. This shirt is so nice. Ooh, they actually got some new ones. Yeah, no, they're, they're putting new stuff on this table all the time. That's why I was like, ooh, what's on the pretty table today? <laughs> There's a leather one now. Is that the bee and the beast? <gasps> you had to see that. Look at there's a beautiful purple leather one now. Purple's my favorite color. Let's <laughs> kill a mockingbird. Little women. The tail of Beauty and the Beast is it's so small. Uh, okay, how much is it? It's smaller than Dorian Gray. It's twenty dollars because yeah. Ooh, I want that edition now. Okay, I'll be back for that. <laughs> and you found your stuff? Unfortunately, I was wrong, and the, the little manga bits still aren't over here. Which but at least the series is. But do you have that one? I do not. This is the one I needed. Oh, cool. Yeah. At least you found something. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so I have one, two, three, and four. So I needed five. Yeah. Okay. I think that's great. That is awesome. <laughs> ABCs. And we are back. We're back. <laughs> and we have a bag of goodies. We got Michael a bag this time. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> we so... got a Laura Olympus bag to go with that Laura Olympus book we found at McKay's last time. Yeah. So you know how I love to explain things that you guys don't care about in my all videos. <laughs> So I'm gonna do it in this video too. So now I'm kind of mad. I really wanted this bag, but now I'm mad that she got it for me because now I actually have to read it. <laughs> Which means now I'm gonna actually want to buy the other, I think there's three or four out now. Probably. Yeah, so now I'm gonna be buying, so yeah. So now I'm, now I'm mad. <laughs> he has to buy it now, apparently, because I got it in the bag. But yeah, it's such a pretty bag. It's really pretty, and I just saw that there's purple, and Sky loves purple, yeah, so. Yeah, he thought I was buying it because it was purple, yeah. and I was like, nah, that's yours. And then I was like, wait a minute. After I'm done and with then, it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, so anyways, let's just get into the haul before we head over to Target. Mm -hmm. Um, yeah, this is the first store, first haul, so. We got some interesting things, at least for, like, us, I think, like. We didn't get, it, it didn't work out the way it usually works out. <laughs> yeah, so normally she only gets books and I only get manga. Yeah, I haven't found a manga in a while, um, but that changed today. <laughs> How many mangas did you get? I got two. And you got three books? Yep, I think. And then I got two books and I got six mangas. Mm -hmm. So yeah, so the sale was on. It was uh, buy one, get one 50% off. On manga and anime. On manga and anime. And, and certain and... books that were marked for it, but. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> so anyway, so we just um, left the cafe and mm. completely forgot to film, but <laughs> I got my uh, chai latte. I had a quiche <laughs> and my coffee still waiting in the car. Yeah, yes, and then, um, and they always do this if you get, buy a purchase. At... It's my favorite part about coming here is seeing what book is five dollars with a cafe purchase. Yeah. So, so if you, <laughs> yeah. So like if you buy, buy something from the cafe, any cafe item, yeah. you can get a five dollar book. And it's a different book every time yeah. we come here. Yeah. And this is retail so cool. eleven ninety nine. Yeah. So this would have been a like twelve dollar book. Seven dollars. Yeah. You... So yeah, we got it for five. Yeah. So we're gonna buddy we're read. We're gonna buddy read the Mary Shelley Club together. It sounded interesting. Yeah. Because I fucked up a last buddy read. He, yeah, we got confused. We communicated <laughs> poorly. <laughs> well, well, okay, so like in my mind, I felt bad that I was like making her wait. So I thought that she was like going to continue reading it. Yeah, I guess he assumed I was just going to plow through without checking to see if he was caught up or not. Yeah, which so, I was not doing. I but, was waiting for him to catch but up. But I felt bad. So in my mind, I was like, oh crap, I have to finish this. So like I could have waited because like. He read the whole thing. Yeah, I read the whole thing. Chapter three. And I mean, what's funny is like she's actually like enjoying it enough, uh -huh. and I didn't, didn't like, like I didn't it. like it. <laughs> I want to know what happened. I forced myself to read it, so I could have waited. <laughs> I would have been perfectly fine with waiting. <laughs> anyway, so, so this is take yeah. two this for is take a buddy read. Two for buddy read. <laughs> We're gonna communicate better this it time. It sounded really good on the back, so yeah. um, <laughs> it's just suspenseful. Mm -hmm. She she joins a school like she's she's getting picked on, and then she joins a club, and that club pulls horror tropey based pranks on the rest of the school and 
they increasingly get out of hand. <laughs> so I'm excited. That's to kind see. of right up my alley. Right? Like, it sounds cool. And, like, the, let's just look at the cover. It's all moody. Like, it looks like a horror movie. It just, I was like, I yeah. saw it on the counter and, like, I, I cut people in line just to grab the book and go ahead and see if I wanted to buy it while we were contemplating purchases. I was like, I'm going to go ahead and read. Um, so, yeah. Very excited about the Mary Shelley Club here. Just track down a killer. Yeah. Yeah. Ooh, someone actually dies. So yeah. it's not just, like, Murder, horror pranks. apparently. Yeah, yeah. No, the pranks oh. devolve. The pranks spiral. And apparently someone ends up dead. So it should be good. <laughs> I'm not waiting for October to read this book. <laughs> yes. I, well, how many, I, I know we should probably do this off camera because I'm making this video too long. But let's see how many chapters there are. Um, well, I guess you're already doing it. I guess we don't both need to look. Well, let's see who finds it first. 47 chapters? That's not bad. Wait, no. Okay. I know they're really, really short. So there's like well, There's 50, about 500 pages. 500 pages? Maybe about. we can read like 50 pages a day. Sure. Would that be too much for you? No. Okay. <laughs> so whenever we stop, we're going to read 50 pages of this a day. I think that's that's doable. Yeah. Yeah, cool. Okay. okay. So that's that. Mm. Okay, so then did you want to show them everything that you got first? I guess, since that's probably what's on top. <laughs> I think my stack's on top first. So we'll go for everything I got, which is, yeah. Yeah, okay. So, um, I guess we'll start with um, the non-manga, the things I normally get. So, I got some regular bookie books, um, just just uh, two more. Um, so, I got the next Five <laughs> Nights at Freddy's Fazbear Frights book. How many book. Of them do you have so far? This is number five, so I have okay. five now. Okay. <laughs> um, and I've read all four, so I needed a new one because I was. Out She's of so good with reading stories. With her reading, <laughs> so, yeah. All those on the back, I have already read all of those, so I needed more. Nice. So there's another one. Um, and then I got the next book in the Warriors series, a series I've been reading ever since I was in middle school. And now that I'm an adult, I'm trying to collect them and reread them all again. So this is another one that I again had four. So this is book five again. So very excited to read that one as well. Um, now for the manga, because I found manga today. No one told me that there was more orange out. <laughs> this, this, just, this just came out. This, yeah. yeah. He, he was telling me this just came out and I just saw this today and I was like, what is that? I don't have that one, do I? I yeah. double checked with him yeah. because yeah. he knows everything I have. I was and, like, I don't have that one, do well, I? Well, what's like, funny <laughs> is I just read, like, not this one, but I read, I just finally fi finished the first part. Mm -hmm. And mm -hmm. then this is coming to me in the mail. I'm so excited. <laughs> so, yes, I'm very excited. Yeah. I don't know if y'all know, but um, I, I've probably said it in a previous one. I love orange. I love this series. Do you have the anime? So, no. <laughs> I just have the manga, but, you know, it's okay. Um, so, got that. And then, uh, after I found that, Boo was kind enough to point out to me that there is a whole new series starting by the same guy called Become You. That's about a band. <laughs> I'm so excited. I want to borrow that and read it. I'm so, just look at how pretty. <laughs> and like, that just straight up looks like Kakeru on the back. I'm going to try not to cry too hard about it, but you know. <laughs> Um, so those are the mangas that I got because you know it was buy one get one so I got me two things by the, the guy who made orange and then highly unusual I found some DVDs she never <laughs> buys new movies and she's the one that will watch she'll watch a movie back to back to back to back to back I'm, I'm not sleeping to it <laughs> I'm not joking like she'll put in a movie and just keep watching it like days at a time because I won't actually be watching it I'll just have it on for background noise but <laughs> But, I like familiar yeah. background noise because if it's familiar, my brain doesn't want to pay attention to it too much. So that way I can still focus on what I'm doing, but my brain's not looking for other things to do, if that makes sense. It does. <laughs> I, I mean, I do that with music. <laughs> so, um, I got some DVDs. I'm really excited. They were also, because they were anime, buy one, get one half off. So, I... Mary and the Witch's Flower, which looks like a Studio Ghibli movie. Not actually a Studio Ghibli movie. <clears throat> But a great animated film, and I love it. It's beautifully animated. If you've not seen it, I highly recommend you trying to look it up on Netflix because just the animation is just wow, I was on gorgeous. Netflix. That's where it was the last time I saw it. Okay. Um, and then this, which was recommended to me a while ago. Um, I don't remember who recommended it to me, but someone recommended it to me, and I found it today. I wasn't expecting to. Um, paprika. 
<laughs> it's an animated movie. Um, I don't remember what they said it was about, um, but it seems to be some kind of sci-fi fantasy tale that will spiral. So excited to see what that's going to be about too. Mm. That looks really interesting as well. Cool. So yeah, I'm I'm very excited. But I yeah. Found I found oh, lots of stuff. It's by the same director of um, Perfect Blue and Tokyo Godfathers. I don't know about Tokyo Godfathers, but Perfect Blue I hear a lot of people like. Yeah. Mm. Cool. Sweet! Okay. I'm excited. I need to buy this. Okay. That's what I got. <laughs> so now for Boo. Yeah, so I guess I'll get my book out of the way. So we already showed. Yeah, we already showed he got the Mary Shelley Club just yeah. like I did. And then this, I just saw the cover and he I. got a book book? Yeah, I got a book, book. <laughs> not, not like like this is like five dollars yeah. something that we're gonna read together. We so always like, get the buddy read book books. Yeah, yeah. So like that's got of his I, own volition. My own. I got an actual book to read by himself. And it, it's like <laughs> it doesn't even have pictures, it's, guys. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's normal print, and it's, it doesn't look like you know too too long. Um, it's a good size book. Yeah, it was in the young adult section, and I always venture into the young adult section. I just never buy anything. Which, we went somewhere we've never been before. Yeah. We went into the kids section. Oh yeah, that was. <laughs> that was actually like a whole new world. There were like so many like old friend books there. Like yeah. you're like, oh, I remember seeing you years ago. Yeah. You're still in print. Look at you. Yeah, it was, it was like a whole new world. It really was. It was, it was, it was, it was really fun. I suddenly remembered yeah. several book series that I was like, oh my god, I want to get that one again. I want to read that one again. I, <laughs> I spent like 30 minutes looking for the Animorphs after that. I didn't find them, by the way, but next time. <laughs> but yeah, so this book, like, um, the cover kind of drew me in. The, the, the colors, like a love story. And then it's I was, a pretty book. and I didn't know that it was queer at the time, but I was like, if this is queer, then I'm going to be He's even definitely more. Gonna get it, yeah. yeah. So then you go ahead and kind of tell them about the back. It's 1989 in New York City, and for three teens, the world is changing. Riza is an Iranian boy who has just moved to the city with his mother. He's terrified that people will find out he's gay, since all he knows of gay life are the media's images of men dying of AIDS. <laughs> Judy is an aspiring fashion designer who worships her uncle Stephen, a gay man with AIDS who devotes his time to activism as a member of ACT UP. Judy has never imagined finding romance until she falls for Riza and they start dating. Art is Judy's best friend and their school's only out and proud teen. Uh, oh, Art is a person. <laughs> he rebels against his conservative family by documenting the AIDS crisis throughout his photographs. As Riza and Art grow close, closer, Riza struggles to find a way out of his deception that won't break Judy's heart and destroy the most meaningful friendship he's ever known. Wow, a complicated love triangle. Yeah. With so, AIDS. <laughs> so leave it to me to find like a queer book that just sounds sight. kind yeah. of depressing now. Mm -hmm. Um, yeah, so I'm really He excited. literally just picked that one off a shelf. He just turned and he was like, ooh. Yeah, I was like, pretty cover. <laughs> and I mean, honestly, I was like, well, it's going to be a plus if they're bisexual and that's like a love and then triangle. They were. <laughs> so. And then it was exactly that. Yeah, so I'm um, sorry I talked so much about a book that you guys don't care about because you're here for the manga. But <laughs> I do um, it to them every time. <laughs> <laughs> so I got uh, six mangas because you know the buy one, get one half off. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And this one I got volume one and it just sounds so freaking interesting. I haven't read volume one yet. That one does sound cool. I think if I'm not mistaken, it's going to be three volumes. So you know how I like to just wait if it's, if it's a shorter series. But this one I might not be able to wait for. Like it just, <laughs> look at the art first off. It's beautiful. Mm -hmm. And I'm so sorry, but please read the back. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Ever felt as if there's no place for you in this world? Bar, California, a secluded establishment where people of various genders, pro propensities, and sexual orientations gather in search of love, sex, and fulfillment. In this installment, Ray Taki tells the story of a young man who loses his same-sex partner to the harshness of society, a lithromantic woman who's scared of getting her feelings reciprocated, and a cross-dresser who has a secret she'll never share. <laughs> so with these two I like queer and depressing. <laughs> Great. Okay. <laughs> uh <-huh. laughs> so this one is not queer. Um but is depressing. But definitely <laughs> it it's about gender. So finding yourself. So yeah, this is a um The Flowers of Evil, dude. Oh 
this is his that's newest. the nicest looking one yet. <laughs> yeah, so you... His covers usually look more evil. <laughs> yeah, do you want to just read that a little bit? I don't have my glasses on, I'm blind, so I'm not, I can't read anything. Middle school is hard enough without problems like these. Toshihiko Ota is mocked by his peers for his smooth, hairless body, but his life changes forever when he meets a young woman in swim club with the opposite problem. Ayako Goto, poised for swim meet glory, but too ashamed of her body hair to compete. After Oda happens on her trying unsuccessfully to shave in the locker room, she comes to him with an astonishing request. Can they help each other find the confidence to embrace their own bodies? Yeah. <laughs> so that one I wanted you to read because I actually want to see what you, you thought of it. That's cute. That's a cute concept. Yeah. I like this. Yeah. <laughs> so. I was that girl in high school. I'm I'm half Hispanic, so I understand the hairy problem. But yeah, so um, Golden Sparkle, not gonna... I found that one for Yeah, him. <laughs> so I didn't even see this, and she's like... I was like, I don't think I've seen this one on your shelf before. Do you have this? And he was like, oh, I was looking for that. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, and it's a one-shot by Sublime. I'm like, yes, mm. definitely. Uh, this one I'm really enjoying. I read the first two volumes, and I'm going to... If I don't get too drunk tonight, I'm going to read <laughs> the third volume tonight. Uh, Crossplay Love, a taco plus punk. This is just kind of like a comedy, um, cross-dressing manga that's hilarious. I absolutely freaking love it. Um, they're introducing the side characters now, um, and love it so much. It, those are the two side characters, but yeah. <laughs> I love it. Love it. It's so funny. Mm -hmm. I think you'd actually like that one. Probably. Oh. oh, oops. But yeah, I know nothing about that, but... Sodas. <laughs> Is that how you pronounce it? I assume, I don't know. <laughs> I'm reading it as I see it written. But it's by Yen Press, <laughs> it's volume one, so yeah. Looks cute. <laughs> yeah. Little and gay. then, last... But not least. The Dragon's Broth? That? Betrothed. Betrothed. The, the dragon's betrothed. The dragon's betrothed. And it's a <laughs> sublime new title. That one sounds fun. Volume one. Yeah. And it's like a fantasy. So. Ancient Magus br Bride vibes. Yeah. But like gay. <laughs> and good. Not boring. The Ancient Magus. I like the Ancient Magus. I'm canceled! I've canceled! You didn't like the Ancient Magus Bride? <laughs> it was okay. I was bored. <laughs> but yeah. Mm. It was okay. Like, it wasn't anything groundbreaking. Yeah. I liked it. Yeah. I liked the aesthetic. I liked too. the medicine part of it. The medicine part? Yeah, there was like that witch that like did medicines. Oh, the blonde? And she, and she made like spell, like oh. potions, potions. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I really like that part. But yeah, if you want to just hold up your stack. <laughs> so yeah, there's, there's his stack and here's my stack. <laughs> so look at that I actually got some manga and some anime and he actually got some book books <laughs> yeah which I'm really freaking look excited at that. about so. <laughs> and it hasn't been like a whole half a year since we're making one of these yeah when <laughs> this did we is go? just insanity <laughs> In last month yeah it hasn't been that long <laughs> wow okay cool. not compared to normal especially <laughs> Yeah, it's gonna only wait like six months. Yeah. <laughs> but then I, I did have that gift card, so. Ah, I'm dropping things. Oh, yeah, so remember I said $5? I only went like $10, <laughs> like about $12 over, so I'll, I'll take it. And I spent about half of what I spent last time, so I'll take that. Was, 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 that, was that your goal? I was gonna spend like 20, I spent double what I meant to spend, but it's okay. <laughs> I also found movies, which I wasn't expecting to find. <laughs> and I found manga that I wasn't expecting to find. Yeah, I, I was coming here specifically for book books, because I was like, based on what I saw last time, there wasn't gonna be any manga in there for me. I was... Lo and behold! <laughs> and what's crazy is that I remember you telling me how much you loved Orange, but like that just like left because <laughs> me reading Orange now was just separate. So like I didn't even know that you read Orange, even though you told me how much you loved it before. But it just, it just didn't kind of, yeah, it just didn't register. <laughs> Love Orange. So you know, actually, you know, and you're, now you're I've seen a bunch of things that I might want to start when we come back. I might get some Nana. I might get some Dead Man Wonderland. I might get some Darling in the Franks if they're still here. Because God knows, every time I seem to come back here looking for something, that's when they take it off the shelf. <laughs> to be fair, you come back like once in the blue moon we were here we literally just discussed how we were here like a month ago <laughs> well this time and around. i saw that manga last time we were here yeah. the one i was looking for with the warriors and it's not there today next time <laughs> let's go to um book familiar <laughs> you're gonna have to drive us there that's fine <laughs> okay <laughs> but yeah you know i have the animated orange right mm -hmm. 
What, what? Have you watched it yet? Yeah. You've already watched it? Yeah, I've oh. seen Orange. Okay, never mind. <laughs> it's a great anime. Um, don't watch it if you're feeling too, too sad. <laughs> I, okay, the book made me cry my eyes out. I'm anime so scared. I'm out. scared to actually watch the anime since it's like gonna be in my face. The anime made me cry, so when I read it in the book, I was like, you can't hurt me anymore. <laughs> But the anime did make me That's cry. Hilarious. And I, I watched it at work, by the way. So I was in the back of my work I was crying. reading. I was reading Orange at work and my co on lunch and my coworker. Don't was watch the last at me. episode of Orange or and read the last chapter of my Orange if you are not somewhere where you may be okay crying. <laughs> yeah, so I was bawling my eyes out and she would just look at me and then I, I like got composure and I was like, okay. <laughs> then I turned the page. Read the next page and start crying again. I'm like, I'm so embarrassed. And she's looking at me. She's like, you know, you're reading a, a book, right? And I was like, yeah. You know that books convey emotions, right? And that I'm a human with feelings. <laughs> <laughs> you lizard. <laughs> well, to to be say. fair, in her defense, I like never show emotion at work. <laughs> so to be fair, she's just like. You have emotions? <laughs> what? Which, uh, <laughs> random note, but I just remember last video I was complaining about how I could never find rings to fit my fingers. Look what I got this video. I got rings that fit my tiny little fingers. <laughs> oh, really fast, do you want to update? Um, if you guys are not, if you didn't watch the last video and you um, want to skip ahead, go ahead and skip ahead now. But if you should have done that a while ago. <laughs> yeah. But <laughs> we are just, whatever. But, um, Update them on the books that you read that you got last time. I've read quite a few. So, like I said, I read all of the FNAF books that y'all saw me buy. That whole book set. I've read all of the all of the uh, Fazbear Frights. Um, I've read all of the Princess Bride, which y'all saw me purchase and as well. And what did you think and of it? I I loved it just like you I love loved it the first time. <laughs> I already all knew them. I loved the Princess Bride. Yeah. I still love it the second time. Um, there were there was a little uh, there, that book was more misogynistic than I remembered it being, but it's yeah. fair because it's really pick old. Up. You probably didn't pick up on it. <laughs> no, back then. no, yeah. <laughs> you can't miss it. <laughs> <laughs> I just forgot about I it forgot for sure. About it, gotcha. <laughs> but um, it's did, a really old. Did book. you still laugh as much as you did the first time? Oh yeah, yeah. oh yeah, it's still still highly entertaining. Um, so um, I finished the Princess Bride, um, which actually has the sequel. I didn't realize that edition had the sequel in there, which was called Buttercup's Baby. So oh, that's I, cool. I read that too. That's um, really cool. Uh, so Princess Bride, Buttercup's Baby, all of the Fazbear Frights, and then I also finished uh, the picture of Dorian Gray. Um, Dorian was an asshole, <laughs> but I did like the book. <laughs> I was I, I was hoping I would like Dorian more. Dorian was a dick. <laughs> no lie. <laughs> Basil was my favorite character. <laughs> the painter. <laughs> okay. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Um, but great book though. Did you read anything read. else? Uh I am um, I don't I don't think so because I was waiting for you for the nothing but black and teeth. So I'll probably finish that Sorry. one pretty promptly now. I, I, was, I read it only because of you. I read it because of I you. I know. So. It's funny how that worked. Yeah. Anyways, we are going to yeah. um, head over to Target mm -hmm. and we will see you there.